ورتل القرآن ترتيلا السلام عليكم In this lesson we will be covering the rule of إدغام شفوي Our learning objectives are Number one To know what إدغام شفوي means Number two To know the different steps in applying إدغام شفوي Number three to know the letters of Idgham Shafawi. And finally, to be able to identify Idgham Shafawi in a given verse and apply it. Idgham means to merge or join. The term Shafawi is used as Mim is one of the letters of the lips. Hence, there is a difference between Idgham and Idgham Shafawi. So if we look at the two examples below, the first is an example of Idgham where the noon sakina is followed by the letter mim and it's read mim ma in the second is an example of idgham shafawi where the mim sakina is followed by the letter mim read walakum ma kasabtum so how do we identify idgham shafawi step 1 find mim sakin Step 2. Look at the letter immediately after Mim Sakin and this applies to all rules. Step 3. The letter after must be the letter Mim. And finally, to hold the sound of Mim Sakin with a Gunna for two counts. So let's look at an example together. Step 1. Find the Mim Sakin. So if we go across, we can see that there is a Mim Sakina. Step 2. Look at the letter immediately after Mim Sakin. Step 3. The letter after must be the letter Mim. So we can see there is a Mim Sakin followed by the letter Mim. Step 4. Hold the sound of the Mim Sakin with a Ghunna. So it would be read Fi Qulubihim Maradun. Now it's time to do one by yourself. Find the Idram Shafawi from the following verse. Resume the video to find the answer. Now let's go through the answer. Step 1. Find the Mim Sakin. So if we go across, we can see there is Mim Sakin. Step 2. Look at the letter immediately after Mim Sakin. Step 3. The letter after must be the letter Mim. And step four, hold the sound of Mim Sakin with a runna for two counts. So it would be read Shuhada Akum So what have we learnt in this lesson? We know what Idram Shafawi means. We know the letter of Idram Shafawi. We know the steps required to identify Idram Shafawi in the Quran and we can identify and apply Idram Shafawi in the Quran. Hope you have benefited from this lesson. Keep seeking knowledge. Ma'as-salama.